did to her hair. It's long enough to put up into a mini. What? Was that a mini pigtail? <laughs> yeah. I'm watching Millionaire Matchmaker right now as well. And I'm thinking about getting lunch so I'm gonna go and get some lasagna which was our leftover last night for dinner so I just can't get myself off of the couch. So I'm transitioning Skylar from a bottle to a sippy cup. Let's see how she does. Good job. Are you drinking from it? Wow, good job. Are you actually drinking? Tip it over. <laughs> Tip it. Yay! Wow, that's pretty good for the first time. Huh. Pretty good, hey? <laughs> yeah? Okay, so... Here is my outfit for our mini date night. We're just going to dinner and a movie. So just all black earthing. And then I got this really nice necklace that goes with the top. Actually, it came together with the top. And my Michael Kors purse there. And I don't know what shoes to wear yet. I don't know if I'm going to wear wedges or flat. There's my makeup. Just very subtle. Like I wanted to do like a subtle beige look for my face. So there we go. Great. Okay, so Chris went out and walked Kona and he brought Skylar with him. They just got back and Skylar fell asleep on their walk, so he's downstairs putting her in the um, car seat in the garage. And now we're gonna go drop her off at my dad-in-law's place so he could watch her for a little bit. And off we go. All right, Kona, let's go. Kona, let's go. Come on. She knows I'm leaving and she doesn't want to go because her crate is down to, in the garage. We moved it to the garage now. So she knows exactly when we're leaving and she just stays put up there. Come on, Kona, let's go. Okay, this is going to be the struggle. We just dropped Skylar off. Chris's dad's house, so hopefully she goes to bed pretty quick because she was asleep the entire time we were driving there. So now we are free <laughs> for a couple hours. Yeah, for a couple hours. But yeah, it's not so sunny anymore at 7 p.m., but it's still pretty hot and humid. I would say. And I feel overdressed and we're just going to like a local restaurant and um, I don't know, are we going to go to the movie? I don't know. We might skip the movie. Depends what time we're done eating. I just, so, I just said if you wanted to or not because you said you were tired. Yeah, I kind of want to watch um, Planet of the Apes if we have time. Oh, we'll have time. We'll make time. Okay, Dad. <laughs> so yeah, Chris is like all casual, and I feel like overdressed over here. It's because I live casual. That's my motto. 
It's my like my life motto, casual. We haven't gone out for a date night for a while. The last time we went was um Joe Fortes. Oh yeah, Joe Fortes. Ah, I think I remember. saw that vlog. But yeah. <clears throat> Parent life. <laughs> We're all about that parenting life. <laughs> So, and plus, like Chris, like Chris works a lot, and he's been working really long hours. This kind of makes up for it, and it's a long weekend here. It's BC Day. Is it today BC Day or on Monday? Monday. Yeah. So, do you have Monday off? Yeah. I mean, no. Anyways, I think we are just heading to a restaurant called Moxie. They used to have this really good dessert there that I always get called Zango and it's like this um, cinnamon and sh sugar like wrapped in like a, how do you say, phyllo, phyllo paper, phyllo paper, like ice cream and caramel, oh my gosh it was so good, but they don't serve it anymore. I hate when that happens, when a restaurant has like this really good dessert that everybody falls in love with and then they stop serving it. Why do you do that? We're starting off with the peach bellini and Chris has a beer of course. He's buying the tickets for the movie right now. We're gonna see Planet of the Apes. This should be exciting. We're gonna go see the movie for the first time in eight months. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Kind of worried about Skylar. Watch this for me. But you know, as a mom, you just get worried. I know she's. I'm not I know she's just gonna be sleeping the whole entire time. That's not true. Hopefully, let's cross our fingers. Here's our food. I ordered the mango chipotle chicken. It looks bomb. Let's see how it really is. And then Chris ordered the fish tacos. Fish tacos. So, I'm gonna test this out. I'll tell you guys how I like it. As you can tell, I'm almost done, which says a lot. It was really good. I had quinoa, lemon herb chicken, beans, avocado, mango chipotle sauce, lemon. So good. I am having a napkin. <laughs> <laughs> He's done his dinner. <laughs> I eat really slow. Or maybe I just eat really fast. Dessert time. Order the caramel, salted caramel, and pecan cheesecake. Woo! Okay. Let's test this bad boy out. You can move the leaf over there. It's a mint leaf. You can eat it. Yeah. We're getting out of here pretty quick because we're gonna go catch our movie. So we're on our way to the movies now. Chris had to get the VIP tickets because there is no um, normal tickets left. They were all sold out. So I don't know if I'm taking you guys to the VIP movie, but basically they serve food to you instead of you going to the concession they just have like a menu for you which is like pretty expensive but whatever only ever gone to a VIP movie once dinner was good I'm full the um, dessert was really good I wish there was more though because I just ordered the mini but it was enough because we had to leave we were in a hurry
Here to put your arms. Here is the menu. All the menu for food. And then the lady comes around and takes your order. Xbox One, now starting at three ninety nine. All right, let's see, what do I want? We just got out of the movie and we're on our way home now. Well, we're picking up Skylar first. Hopefully she's fine and she's sleeping. Well, Chris's dad hasn't called us, so everything must be fine. And the movie was really good, so if you haven't seen Planet of the Apes, Forgot to mention we got free courtesy tickets. You can't even see them for next time because it was really hot in the theater. So they gave us two free tickets. What was there we go. Now you can see them. Two free courtesy tickets. She knows how to play peekaboo. She knows how to joke around. Mm -hmm. 